the fighter. Roth Mosser. Giver of IRAs. <laughs> Roth's claim to fame was as a hireling for the town defender. Bronnar. Already hate it. Brown noser. <laughs> he helped his hometown put down a small goblin den from the nearby woodland caverns. Did you chat GPT this? Yeah, I bet he did. No, I didn't. I sat here from six to seven uh, typing it up. That's chat GPT. It is <laughs> not. <laughs> uh, see, this is just going to get them to mass their forces. We should creep in there and take them out piecemeal. Oh, this is dumb. All right. Oh, shit. Yeah, let's back off. And we're running. And, oh, yeah, here's the thing. <laughs> Maybe they're looking for prisoners. Well, it doesn't look like it. Mom's going to be licking their lips, pointing to a large cauldron. All right, boom. Boom, I'm through and I'm out. So long, suckers. I think Skank just went there. You were both running away. Yes, very, very fast. <laughs> Fucking debacle. <laughs> Fucking debacle already. Jesus Christ. <laughs> this is... He probably made it out, right? I mean, what was the last thing you saw? Uh, I don't know. Maybe he like like got captured and maybe we can rescue him later. Perhaps. <laughs> <laughs> That's the plan. That's the plan we're going with. We're gonna <laughs> we're gonna mount a rescue mission someday. So someday. I mean there's obviously we gotta get a lot more people and better at skills but you know if he can just hold on if he can just yeah they're probably yeah. torturing him stay alive we will find you we, we never leave a you. man behind that's right we'll get to it eventually we're assuming he's captured and they're doing like butt stuff to him like kobold torture butt stuff his chastity is is uh it's in peril violated nightly <laughs> uh, yeah, my name's corbin I used to be a guard, then I got kicked in the head by a mule. If you use the battle axe. Okay, okay, got it, got it. So you were a guard, huh? What was that like? Uh, I don't remember too good, but I think we hit stuff a lot. <laughs> Corbin, that's a hit. Corbin gets hit for six points of damage. Corbin hit one as well. Yeah. Copa Dallas, Copa Dallas, Copa Dallas, Copa the man. Hits, kills him. Yeah. Oh, Corky. Life doesn't go on. Corky. <laughs> I get it. I get it. It, it took, took a minute. It took a second. It took a second. Let's get Dauber from Coach to attack. <laughs> he misses. <laughs> oh, Dauber. Third turn. <laughs> Dauber from Coach. Yes. Oh, Dob's going down. All right, he's down. All right. I'll carry the fat one. You carry the retarded one. <laughs> he's dead. Oh, is he dead? He's dead. He's gone, man. That's my associate over there. Callisto. Female elf. Yeah, here we go. Now, now we got a party. She's got a monkey hanging around her neck. Why are you traveling with her? Have you seen her? I look disgusted. Her monkey chitters at you. Right. Is that a euphemism for her private parts? No, her, she has a <laughs> She's got a monkey around her Oh, the monkey, the monkey. Yeah, the monkey. It sticks its hand in one just as you do and starts screeching. It pulls back and you see an ochre jelly on the monkey. Oh, no! Ah! It's a giant amoeboid thing. It's trying to eat the creature. The woman tries to grab the, the ochre jelly off the creature. That's going to work out well. Yeah. <laughs> she succeeds in ripping it off the monkey, but now it's attached to her. At least she saved the monkey. That's true. It dissolves all of her arm off. Oh, sh oh. oh my God. I chopped this elf's arm off. Yeah, so that woman's probably dead at this point. Is he, like, staring with a squint off into the sun? <laughs> Just flashing back to when we first met. Oh, man. When all things come to an end, man, times change and we change with them. He begins to sing, Dust in the wind. I close my eyes. I am Franz the Fantabulous. I am a master of majory. He casts floating disc. <laughs> he jumps on the floating disc and stabs at the shrew beneath him with a dagger. <laughs> awesome. He hits. He casts a spell. Ventriloquism. Yes, exactly. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> All of a sudden, from behind, 
when you hear, all of you stop in the name of the Castellan. <laughs> all of the halflings turn their heads, distracted by the noise. <laughs> that actually worked. This guy with his crappy spells. One of you is going to have to strike up a torch. How about a lantern? You got a lantern? I do, but somebody needs to carry it. I'm not going to carry it. I'm a thief. I, I do thief things. Where the fuck aren't you carrying it? I do thief things. My hands are clearly hold full. On, hold on. Wasn't there a mage with you guys? When did that happen? What? Yeah, what the hell? There was a mage. Remember he kept casting... Uh... Oh, yeah! That's right, that guy! He used uh, the floating disc. Yeah, he was fabuloso or something. Yeah, fantabulous, right. <laughs> oh, he's with you, too. He casts light. Oh, Jesus. Fantabulous. Where did you even come from? You hear a roar. A mountain lion leaps from a tree and jumps on Fabuloso. A mountain lion? It's Manimal. Fabuloso is down. There are three down. McTuffins is at zero. I'm, I'm self-stabilized. I'm fine. Fabuloso is dead. No! We hardly knew him. That's the least fabulous thing we've ever seen. Hey, Fabuloso died, man. We, we just left him there. Should we go back and bury? Nah, fuck it. Let's just. What qualities are you actually looking for? Uh, strength. Uh, any that like walk with like a bow legged. Maybe they're holding like their tool or something like that. They know how to holding their tool, handle it. Rippling muscles as they yes. climb their yes. thighs up to their buttocks. Yeah, you see one huge muscled guy. Where are you coming from, son? I'm selling the hogs. What you doing with the rest of your life? <laughs> yeah. I lug loot. Really? You have experienced you in that. I'm Larry the loot lugger. Did you see the people's heads I bashed in to get these hogs? Their <laughs> brains went all over the place, let me tell you. Seriously, guys. <laughs> <laughs> so, Larry, do you have any useful skills? Do you know how to, like, um, uh, make a camp or anything like that? Cook? Well, when I need to make a camp, I usually found someone else's camp and then use that. And then, you know, after I strangled them. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Let's just get rid of this guy. This guy is just a huge problem. Mm, this is not good. Is there a window? Yes. Larry's climbing out of it. Did Larry set this place on fire? All of a sudden, you notice that standing over his body is Larry. Oh, oh fuck. How the hell did he follow us here? Do we want to just kill this mofo right now? I think that might be our best shot. Do it. Do it. He does not penetrate his armor. Larry runs away. I didn't attack you. These guys did, Larry. Rob. I remain unconscious. Andrew. I try to take a hit while he's distracted. Here comes Big D20X swing. I'm hewing at this man. 18. Yay. Seven. He's dead. Ah! Ah, I claim the victory. Skate coming up big. Larry, I think you should just leave. All right, you got a guy there, small pig-like eyes. <laughs> he's got a brand on his head indicating that he's a criminal. Yeah, I'd say it's a pink flag. I don't know if that's a red flag. And he sweats constantly. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, I think it was a different table you were looking for. I think the waitress must have been confused. Hey, buddy, what's your name? Good, good. They call me Handsome Ansem. McTuff. Yeah. McTuff, are you worried that we're going to have two sweaty guys in the in the group now? Yeah, I've kind of got that market corner. Why are you sweating so much? Did you just run in here? Well, you know, it's hot. He's not wrong. It is a little warm. He's also wearing a thick poncho over his leather armor. Could I be wearing any more clothes? <laughs> <laughs> you see various weird bulges under it. <laughs> Immediate hire. I want this guy. He's probably three gnomes in an overcoat. Oh, my God. He probably is. I think this is what you've talked about as a red flag. <laughs> no, fuck it. I walk into the room. I'm tired of this shit. I walk into the room. We've been standing around outside the doors talking for hours now. I'm done. The one thing that we know factually about this room is something in here killed two goblins. How's our six back there, guys? Is it checked? <laughs> Oh, Jesus Christ. It goes up. Yeah. I, I high-five Renee. All right. Yeah, that's how we do it. How's our six back there, guys? Hiding in the back, scamming XP and treasure? Poor handsome. 
So Renee picks him up and throws him down in the pit, drops the torch in after him. Just adds to the cycle of life, man. We're looking for men. Large, strong men. Men who are willing to do anything. Possibly oily. <laughs> Is there anybody that looks like Lorenzo Lamas? <laughs> yes, there's one exactly like him. A renegade. Oh, excellent. That guy's hired. You, what's your name? Rene Gade. I play by no man's rules. Dude, how do you get your hair to do that? There's no wind in here, and yet it's blowing. I guess it's uh, you and me up front with the fat guy behind us? I don't think so. No one tells me what part of the party I'm standing in. Oh, he's such oh, a fucking he's renegade. So cool. He's such a renegade. Oh, that was awesome. He's like a wolf. You can't tame him. We're gonna come up with a party order and uh, renegade, man. You can you can just just wherever you feel, yeah, where, whatever, wherever. Whatever you want, we'll work with you. Wherever it takes you. Where do you want us to go, renegade? Who should go first? All right, good. The dwarf goes first. Sounds like a plan. And then my girl goes. Yeah. Then I'll go, and then Mac Tuffins, Skank, then Fantabulous. It's a good plan. <laughs> cool, cool. <laughs> renegade pushes past you. I'm not even following that plan. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! That's so him. That's so him. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> no, I need a minute, guys. Oh, oh. Renee got hit. Got now. Oh no! He's pretty bad. My turn. Yeah, one baby. I failed as hard as I could. How's Renegade doing? Well, percentage dice. I'll give him a 50 50 shot. Lance, we already blame you for what happened. So. Oh, no, don't put it on me. 51% or higher, and he'll be all right eventually. I rolled a four. He's dead. Lance, you are the worst. An elf bounds up to. Holy shit, an elf. Holy shit, a halfling. You guys are not going to start frolicking spontaneously, are you? No, that's the traditional demi-human greeting. I am Poos of the Virginia's Eye. Poos? Poos. I heard Poos. Archer extraordinaire. All right, you're in until you're dead. Andrew, you're there with the three NPCs. The big giant wolfy creature? What's going on with that? We're about to have a combat. Oh, no! no. Palouse pulls out a crappy bow and shoots an arrow. It's like it's uh, broke at some point and was sort of nailed together. <laughs> He's like a worst elf ever. He hits two. Our NPCs are awesome. We suck. <laughs> what are you talking about? I did almost full damage, too. Are you there? Yeah, are you there? <laughs> <laughs> As Mad Hermit appears behind um, Palouse and stabs him in the back, Palouse draws a short sword, hits for D6. No! <laughs> Is he unconscious or he's dead? Well, dead? He's down. You don't know. He got stabbed three times and failed his poison roll. We hardly knew him. <laughs> you see them appear at the edge of the hill. You do notice you're missing one guy. We lost the elf. What was his name? I, I, you don't honestly... Wait, I'm already bored. Poop shoot or something. I don't know. Poop shoot. <laughs> <laughs> his name was Poops. <laughs> Didn't do it. <laughs> Do we want to bring his body back, or do we just want to treat him, <laughs> no, we treat him like we treat all the NPCs? <laughs> <laughs> we just left him on the hill. Yeah. Just kind of flush him down the top. <laughs> Poor NPCs. A guy walks up to you, chewing on a large ham. How are you doing, gentlemen? What is your name? Oh, I am Sir Samwine of the Realms. Oh, oh, oh. You're really enjoying that ham. <laughs> Cut you off a slice and throws it at you. He's very generous. I give my ham to the monkey. The monkey begins slapping it on the table. Hey, mister, are you an adventurer? I want to be. Now I'm out of work since my uh, lord recently died. Figured I'd make a little bit of money for myself, huh? Hey, mister, if you put that ham on the table and use your sword, you, could, could you cut us off a piece? Do you want another piece, little guy? I'm actually kind of happy you didn't call me little girl, so yeah, please. 
Oh, no. Ah. Ah. So Sam Wade begins screaming and runs away. <laughs> so Sam Wade comes back. Oh, hi, guys. Sorry about that. <sighs> it's just really creeped me out, you know? Dwarf Brothers, ho. Pick the door and I run in. Ah, I don't like that at all. What? We need your holy power. So Sam Wade runs around the corner. He's even worse than Lance. My knuckles are white against the holding the hilt of my sword. You people with your undead, I mean. I know. Backstories are cool and all, but Jesus. You're all covered in weird colors, man. Oh, Sir Sam Wayne is going in there. Oh, I hate hobgoblins. I love to kill them. Five points on Sir Sam Wayne is down. You guys go to sleep. Yep. <laughs> Brandon says, should we have tried to get Sir Sam Wayne? Oh. What? Who? I forgot about him. I'm not going back. They were going to killed. Who was in charge of bringing him? I don't know. That seems kind of dishonorable to just leave him back. I forgot about him entirely. That's just I did, too. Oh, my God. (laughs) I just didn't even think about him. Wow. (laughs) We're terrible. We're just bad people, man. We're bad. Weep not for the memory.